Hey guys, it's me, Larry Lawton here. Listen to discretion. Many of the topics in this episode were spoken about in a completely jokingly and sarcastical way. How the f do I say that? Do I look like a f scientist? <laughs> completely jokingly and sarcastical. How the f am I supposed to say that? What the f is your problem, Come on! The theoretical mana, at least. Some of them. Wasteland of Lamb, Babidder, and Filthy Moose, as well as other representatives of the Wasteland of Podcast, do not condone every opinion said in this. I can't do it. This is ripped by like a fucking two year old. What the f do you want? <laughs> with these podcasts. Enjoy the fucking episode. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Wastelander, an ATF podcast. I'm your host, Wastelander, and here's your other host, Filthy Moose. What's up? Uh, today, we have a couple guests with us Filthy Interstellar, Filthy Julian, Flower Boy Andrew, Real Iden, Skaven Blight, Soul Jagoy, and Zalev. How's everybody doing today? Good. 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 God bless. Good. So I'm going to address the elephant in the room. Uh, Hayes, what what happened with your whole uh, like triopium thing? I remember the whole thing that happened with uh, Daredevil yeah, DJ. Get your, get your time, man. And, uh, yeah, no, 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 no. Th- th- those were like those were fall guys. Those were uh, fall guys. Sh- so like, what? The, the ripping ain't even ain't even over yet. Oh shit, for real? Yeah, we're still feeling the fallout from it now. Shit ripples. They shit ripples far. Honestly, it, it has been it has a lot of parallels. <laughs> exactly. Not say hello. Love, love, love the guy. Uh, they love amazing, amazing owner CDF. So were you, uh, Hayes? That was I don't know. That was like I remember like back when we were like good friends when you were um. A faction rep you were like really into atf and all that and then like you know you became an rpm you became a trial mod whatever you want to call it, trial pm and like it was really you know like i was i was happy for you but then like the whole thing happened i'm like shit like it must have been really bad if you like quit me and julian were talking and uh we agreed that it's a parallel to the sort of epstein situation going on in real life appalling. It's, it's, it's appalling it really is chad, chad is a good guy you know i've yeah. talked to him personally yeah, chad, a few is, times. chad is a good chad. guy chad chad is a great guy you know he's a great guy <laughs> genuine he's, he's genuine. handling it very you know the whole uh atf thing like he's handling it more from a business standpoint but like yeah there are uh a few you know uh like bad apples in the community i guess so i don't blame you for quitting but that whole fucking situation that happened that kind of like it illuminated everyone's views on the community i guess or at least some people about like the whole yeah, i remember um, at least yeah. was, uh, I'm pretty sure a bunch of other lpms when that whole schism popped up um like i think six other lpms were getting dm'd and uh given like a lot of death threats yeah because they were they thought they were that's the one thing i feel bad about like a lot of lpms that were just kind of doing their job they didn't really do anything they got a lot of backlash from it like mm-hmm. i felt bad for them you call that whole uh thing kind of reddit justice some Jesus something Christ. bad happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, the I wrong love, people get blamed. I love Reddit, you guys. I love her. I love, I love uh, such Reddit. wholesome JoJo. Oh yeah, how I'm much karma you guys have? Uh, uh, I, I, mean, I don't have Reddit. <laughs> I've, ne- I've never seen Reddit. Why not? Zayla, Zayla, how, how much karma? Love, how much karma right? do you love have on Reddit, Zayla? What's your Reddit? Oh, I don't even care about it so much. Ah, jeez. But yeah, like, Hayes, what have you been doing now with your time now that, like, you know, you don't, you're not really focused on ATF anymore? And, like, what have you been, like, doing for the most part? I'm in love with you, Chad. I'm in love with you, right? All right. A, a big, a big reason, of course, you know, why Julian left the whole TDF is because, like, they, the ring they're set up there is really appalling. Like, He's a so good size, they, they figured out he wasn't running it. Um, yeah. Uh, Julian had like a lot of shit to do while he was actually like running the CDF, so he had to step yeah. out a lot. I, I was kind of putting the shit together. I was kind of pulling the strings, and uh, I mean, shit just popped off. They kind of figured out he wasn't running it, or for most of the time. Of course, he was sometimes. And they're you know, the fire's getting hot. You, they're telling him to step down and shit, and then he just left on his own. I mean, I don't blame you, man. Like running the CDF, that shit must have been really time consuming. But Julian, uh, to be fair, you did tell me that you completely put school aside for the CDF, which I respect greatly. So Crazy real in, uh you own the CDF right now, don't you? Um, begrudgingly, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so do you is owning the CDF now any different than it would be for people like Zaylev or Julian when they owned it, or is it pretty much the same? Um, we haven't really changed too much. Although we, uh, I, I haven't really bothered to do it. Um, although I do want to do some stuff with uh the ranking because Leo changed that around and I just didn't feel like it was really necessary to do that um but it might i might might or may not be like reverting that back otherwise i mean not really much is different from the whole thing uh although we have been doing like a little bit of changes with srs but that's pretty much it everything else is remaining Mm -hmm. absolutely the same and you own the bounty right 
uh, we yeah. all are. We all are yeah. for various things. The things uh, Interstellar and Julian have done, I don't know if I don't know if I can say them without being bleeped. I'm not even joking. Man, Horrendous. Man, if they did in real life, they'd be locked away for years. Guys, a liar. Get him out of here. I'm not lying. Fuck off. But no, filthy Julian. What? How was like for you owning the CDF? I remember you owned it for a particular amount of time. I think you did an outstanding job. But like, how how was it for you, like running it? Honestly, like the entirety of the activity in CDF is like headed by our AI, my Google Nineties. Um, like he's an Armenian bot that we. He's a robot. Yeah. He's a robot. Yeah, he's he's just been doing all of our hosts for the most part, and that's that's like we. It's kind of like autonomous almost, and we kind of like programmed him to just like keep doing the same routes over and over. So. I mean, it's self-sustaining the whole group anyway, so we can do pretty much whatever we want. How is it being an LPM though, Reelden, or moderator, um, whatever you want to call it? You want me to tell you the truth? Yeah, full uh, truth, man. It's uh, yeah. it's, it's, it's pretty, pretty boring. Bleak. Boring. It's pretty boring. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I'm actually a little bit. Uh, I would like deny it if I had the chance to do that again. I'm probably gonna be leaving like this month, actually. That ass. That really? Ass. Yep. Is it that like boring and like time consuming? It's it's, it's not time consuming. Um. Although it's kind of like strenuous on you, like after a while. I mean, like I, I, I haven't even been in LPM that long, so it's not even like I can say I'm a veterinated like person. I, yeah. I, I must just be like thin skinned or something because I just can't handle it. I guess. Mm -hmm. it's, yeah. It's a it's a big pain in the ass. I'm not I'm not gonna lie though. Like that that raid that happened earlier today between uh, the TMP and no, the that's, that's, that's pretty mild as compared to a lot of the other stuff. Uh, oh God. You see you see a lot of um, I mean you mostly see a lot of like pedos like even now like during our trial period it was I, I i'm not even joking with you i think we like blacklisted a pedo almost like every one to two weeks and we had to like see oh, all the shit that they said like, like, that like dead ass no meme oh yeah dead ass no meme like we had the we That's had a fucking scene. riot of a trial period julian and i you can always tell you together always movies. together this the whole, the whole scene is appalling it makes you say yeah because no, no one realizes it because you know it's under this this it's behind the curtain, really. Yeah. Can I can I drag can I drag Pogonet in for like ten seconds? Ten seconds. If you drag him in, I'm, I'm gonna call him the F word. That ass. I mean, he wants Ooh. he wants me to drag him in. Take, so like, drag, I mean, him in. If drag him in. Drag him in. Drag him in. Drag him in. Okay. This, yeah, this, for, this for okay. 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 I'll drag him in. I'll drag him in. I'll drag him in. Hello, Pogonet, aka Terra Verbis. Hey, you fucking. Fuck you. Get the fuck out of here. You don't get my friend Leo. Get the fuck out. Whoa. What? That's awesome. Thank you for the warm introduction. Well, I think me and Salev had a falling out. Snoring. I used to be madly in love with him, you know. But yeah, that day is groups. over. If you just got to get the you want, you wouldn't have this guy in here. I'm just saying. Like, <laughs> why is your brother <laughs> sound like a rude? Oh, Julian, brutal. why'd you call me, man? What happened? Yeah, what? Because he's a bro. You know what he did to my friend Leo. Get this guy out of here. I fucking hate him. Get him out of here. Don't give him a You know, you oh, seem seriously. like a mad baby at the moment. Squash the beef right here. I, I, I am uh, a beef. I, I did not Chad know you hated me so much. This was this is very watched. surprising since I'm mad. Yeah, you know you did with Leo. You. Get the fuck out of here. He doesn't Who's he's Leo? To around it. Oh, the the, the report sheet. Yeah, yeah. I think it's the report sheet I filed out on Leonide. I did do that, by the way. It got leaked. Me. Pretty much all just me baby raging. That was pretty much it. I got banned from Myriad like super long ago, and I filed this report sheet, and they kind of hate me for it now. I think that's the beef, at least. I don't really know. Why not squash the beef right here, man? Shake hands, become friends. Yeah, because this is what this is what ATF is. People hold grudges, uh, understandably so. I was wrong to file it, but it wasn't me who got him removed. That's what you kind of need to realize here. None of that was incriminating. There was none of that. Was it, it was all pretty much fluff anyway. I think it's a one-sided beef here. Uh, Look, I apologize to Leonide. I don't know if you knew this. I, I went in his DMs when the leak fuck. happened. Get yeah, I know you don't give a fuck. You know, Shake you know, you're kind here, of a, maybe, maybe you know, give him a nice little smooch. Feel like you're kind of, you know, dumber than a bag of rocks. I feel like uh, you want to take a rocks on this. You know, rocks. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I make him so shake him around. <laughs> this is a donkey podcast. I want this guy we'll out of here. You know, my my client doesn't want him here. Your, your client, filthy Julian. We're just wasting time. We're getting off topic. I think. 
Um, thank you oh, for boy. having a part in the podcast, uh, Tara. Yes. Thank um, you, Tara Verbis. That was welcome. beautiful. You're thank welcome. you. Maybe we'll see in a couple episodes. Oh, right, see that was. Let's let's continue with the podcast. That was great. Actually, you know what? I think you should probably ask. Uh, what, can what can I say? I'm not gonna lie. Julian warned you. Uh, the guy, the guy sees red. The guy sees red when he's around. Look, man, I just like why can't you find out of the goodness of your heart just the ability to forgive him, man. You you know what he did to Leo? It was deep cutting stuff. It was deep cutting stuff. Just because they're saying it was just saying it was fluff doesn't doesn't matter. Huh? It's, it's still it's still out there. Oh, it's, uh, tell us a fact about sea slugs. Sea slugs. It's a random uh, sea slug. I love fact. Fucking, I, mean, I fucking love sea slugs. Give me a second. Give me a second. Let me even rack my brain okay. for my little okay. facts. Um, you guys know. That the sea slug is such a common name for some marine invertebrates with varying levels of resemblance to terrestrial slugs. There's a fact did, for you guys. I, I did not know that. Thank you. Oh, genuinely, they don't even live more than a year. Do you know that as really? well? Really? They don't live more than a year. Wow. Stuff. The Wastelander you, you really episode that. 5 slug talk. Uh, it's actually really interesting. I'm not going to lie to you. Took... Did you know that? Well, I want the whole thing out there. This is genuine. This is, yeah. this is real. <laughs> These are hot takes. The <laughs> name slug actually applies to many different types of gastropods. I did not know that. I was like, if you stab too, the fucking slugs, garbage, these people. Makes me sick to my stomach. Oh, yeah. can I talk about a specific slug? Hold on. Uh, in edit it, when you're editing, pull up this picture. It's called a head shield slug. And uh, it's, po- <laughs> it's posted. Post, it. post in a uh, guest chat. Yeah, hold on. Let me pull up the page. Right? Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, are you are you into slugs as well? Zaylev knows oh, his uh, sea slugs. Oh, oh wow, that's an amazing sea slug. Oh, Jesus, slug facts. It really, really is. It really is. Wait, so Reludent, like, can you manage your IRL priorities with your LPM ones? Like, is that hard to do with that job? No, it's not. No, people who say being an LPM is extraneously hard. Um, it's not especially hard if you. Uh, how can I put this nicely? Um, I'm not saying you should ignore every DM that you get, but if someone's asking you for like EOD armor or something, just ignore it. Like, it doesn't take up all the time in the yeah. world to do to do it. Like to be an LPM anyway. Mm, yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, so I mean, plus I don't really have that much that many priorities except for school, like outside yeah. of ATF. So I'm pretty good as it is. Uh, so about the CDF, like. What was the hardest part about running it? Like, 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 genuine question. Like, what would you say was the most difficult part for like both Julian Reeldon and Zaylev about like managing it and like running it? For me, so far, it's been about event planning. Honestly, also, uh, also raids. Just like, raids. just uh, scheduled dot like scheduled shit mostly has been like an issue because uh, everyone hates the CDF. Like literally every every person oh, in geez. the game wants it out for the CDF, um, so it it can be a huge pain in the ass to really kind of like maneuver around that kind of stuff, especially with event planning, because it, it's definitely seen as a punching bag faction. You know why? You know why? Because so CDF doesn't doesn't kill the commands. Okay, we keep it pure. It's a kid's game, and, and you know you just want you just want these uh, little chitlins to have fun. Uh, <laughs> uh, what about you, Zayla? What, what would you, what would you say was the hardest part about running the whole faction? On on September thirteenth, nineteen ninety six, a wonderful soul was taken from us. That soul is Tupac Shakur. He's right. He's right. He's still alive. Let's have a moment. Let's have a moment of silence for the death of Tupac Shakur. Three, two, one. I just gotta, I just gotta, I, just, I, gotta, I gotta give it a water, water. yard. Everyone who's so great people that can show respect. Yeah, beautiful people, you have golden hearts. And uh, I mean, exactly. nothing else I can say. Uh, Purple Haze, but for you, like, genuine question though, what would you, what would you say was the hardest part about running the whole faction while you were owner? Um, I, I'd have to say it was like, you know, wrangling all of the CDF LRs together. It, it, it's, it's actually like literally a hard task to get them all yeah. together. Um, in, 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 let, let yeah. me let my friend in a pizza. So, yeah, yeah, like I said before, you know, I was really helping Julie run the whole thing. It's like it's like trying to trying to put beetles, put beetles in a in a in a can. All right, that must be really difficult. It's really difficult. I mean, they all bitter and they argue with each other. Ah, jeez. It's, uh, it's you know, it's a it's a handful. What about the raids? How was organizing the raids? Would you say horrible? No, horrible. no, no, no. Actually, um, 
see, I, I handled like a lot of the important raids because I, I, I was technically the LPM and it was kind of, I kind of had to. Yeah. And um, it was it was like I, I don't I don't understand how factions can lose raids. It's so easy. This guy had the hang of it. I didn't. Whenever every time the CDF lost a raid, it was because I was actually on Dylan's account running it. And that's 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 not it. That's like not a lie. I was on running raids when every every raid that CDF lost, that's on me. Jeez. Sorry, y'all. Oh, yeah, like I, I lost, I lost one raid during my ownership. I orchestrated a lot before them, and uh, you know, energy. Yeah. We we kind of went fifty fifty on that, but uh, we lost one raid, right? And uh, it, it was a raid where neither me or Interstellar was present. Interstellar actually did win a few a few raids during my ownership. Kind of made me proud of him. Yeah, yeah. yeah it, it it was it, you know very easy. Oh, honestly, I, I don't know, I don't know how people struggle with that. On top of that, I mean, we were winning these raids, and they kept skewing it against us. I mean, it, it, it was it was beautiful. <sighs> I mean, it was Classic beautiful. Probably won. Story. I mean, under, underdogs every time. Underdogs yeah. every time. Hamid, all these they don't they don't want us to win. Because you can see it. You can see how many people that more than us. How many fucking Mark II suits, and they lose every time. Guys Dang. are complete shit. And so, wouldn't you agree that we are the shining gem of this community? Of the I mean, I tell you, we, we, we were. We everything, were. bro. Everything. All the offshoots. They're Everything. lost without you. Now that you guys left. They really are. Exactly. I, 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 I mean, don't, it's, I, the future for ATF is so uncertain now that we're all gone. It's just, boy, it just it makes me sick to my stomach seeing these guys. It's like the, the bad the bad guys have won. You know what I mean? What about what about you, moms? How, what experiences have you had in like the CDF? Well, I mean, like most of the role plays that I had were just like me being gay as like one of my characters. Really? That was my only thing, really in the CDF was just like guys, like, guys, two D, guys, two D. It was, it was kind of hot, I'm not going to lie. Andrew probably oh, single-handedly made the femboy CDF trope. That was God all damn. of him. It was only him. Sick guy, that guy, that Andrew. Sick. It's disgusting what he does. Yeah, I, I, mean, I got away fans. with it, too. Like, I got away with it. Like, no one, no one found out. Do you out. still, you still fuck with ATF, uh, moms? Flower boy, Andrew? A little bit. A little, a little bit. bit. Yeah, I still play with ATF sometimes. Um, I do mostly what Julian does and just, like, like... That's really uh, that's the only thing ATF is good. I, I tell people like, um, oh yeah, I'm, I'm in ATF. It's like I like you guys, but I don't like them. Fuck those guys. Like I I always promise people I'm their friend, but I'm, I'm just in it for the ERP. The, the things Andrew did, man, they 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 were enough to make a fucking angel weep. Like it was, was just it was just like horrible. Say what up? What about you? Besides bludgeoning the fucking normal. CDF Discord, what uh what cool experiences have you had? Damn. I hated most of them. I hated most of the people I met. Most of the games, most of the oh, stuff. Uh, shit. Even you, actually, I hate you. You hate me? What do I do? You just, you sicken me. You're a mere ah, friend. Fuck, me. man. He's a, he's a nihilist. A lot of people don't know that they love a real nihilist. He just does not like anything. Uh, does not believe in God I mean, at that. all. He, 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 does, he does not believe in the afterlife. What other God does happen? I don't understand. What's my God? He goes on for hours like this. Let's talk about how God is not exist. You don't sit him in the I beginning, mean, God created the heavens and earth. Now the earth was formless and empty. Oh, those time, those time <laughs> off, seriously, those time off. It's, it's good as a real time off. He'll, he'll, he'll go on for hours. It's obviously a lingerie. I just don't get it. Such a lot of nerves. Sick. Uh, yes. Golden heart. Real sick of mine. Stop mean. talking about me, Taylor. What are you talking about me for? I'm not even talking about you. I'm talking about, oh my God. What is up with you today? What's up with you? you you're starting us on air. Yapping in my ear. Nice. Look, always you I was talking about Zayla. Always you starting. You sick. You sick nah, fuck. fuck. Shut you, up. Bro. Shut, shut up. up. We're talking. You shut up. Get off the podcast. Oh, can we get Outlawish in here? I am Outlawish. Oh, how about Phil? Oh, yeah. The owner of uh, Survival Mode. Uh, yeah, you know him, Wastelander. I don't know. You know who? You know who gets in here? You know who should get in here? Nikki. Nikki needs to get in here. Get Nikki. Love Doc, guy. Yeah, Shad knows him. Shad loves him. We all love him. Uh, Zaylev, I, I have a question from Sam. Right does stuff. Uh, ask Zaylev if he's diag. What the fuck? It's fucking diagonal. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't do that. I can't read. I'm sorry. Fucking retard brain. Hey, Andy, Andy, cut it. Cut it. Hey, Liv. You don't know Sam does stuff. I'm not answering. I don't know who he is. He's a real piece of shit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, honestly, uh, we'll honestly. move on from that straight, question. Straight, straight from his mouth. I mean, the guy's a golden heart. The guy's a golden heart. Great guy. Say love. Love the guy. We got we got special guest boys. Uh, Boom Daka, a.k.a. Filthy Nikki. Let's drag him in. Nikki! 
Somebody want to fucking explain to me why push to talk is on? Why is push to talk on? Why the fuck do I got to hear you? You're God, man. You love you. Just uh, limit the disturbances, you feel? How are you doing on this fine night, Boondaka? Fucking, I don't know. How am I doing? I'm doing all right, I guess. Fucking. Uh, what experiences have you had from ATF, Nikki? I'm I'm actually genuinely curious. Uh, I got banned. Yeah, what was that whole situation with the with the oh, filthies black. and the, the MEB? Black. What happened? Uh, pretty much, we the bunch of filthies got on the ATF Deep Six. We decided we were gonna do some shit in the Soup Shark, and we fucking we took some hostages, and the MEB didn't like that, and then they pulled up like an APC. Yeah. And like tear gas and shit, and then we killed them, and then I got banned. What the fuck? I hear Zaylev is in Zaylev here. Zaylev is right here. Like, I don't know if it made me Zaylev, sick. Zaylev, tell your uh, Nick, filthy Nikki is is the special guest for you, Zaylev. You have anything to say to him? I thought it was your bad appeal. Oh, guy, gold. No, oh, oh, so this one time, so this one time, I was fucking. I was uh, there's this hole in my back. There was this hole in my backyard because yeah. they were working on the the plumbing, right? The, there was mm -hmm. something wrong with like plumbing, and there was a. Uh, it was a straight up like the the there was a pipe and it was going straight up out of the ground like uh, I don't know the word but it was sticking yeah. straight up out of the ground and I, I took I had a little plastic ramp this was back when I was like thirteen and I had a little bike like a BMX bike and I was gonna jump the fucking hole yeah. right and uh, so I tried to and then I landed right I landed right oh, on it one of my nice. I had to go to the hospital because one of my <laughs> went up inside of me bro. Uh. It went uh, up inside of me, and they had to surgically, like, they had to pull it out with, like, tweezers and that's shit. That's a fucking lie. A lie it's right there. It's a pathological lie. It, it, yeah, is yeah, not, it is not a lie. It's oh, not even, it's, I'm not even home. kidding. Nick, I'm not Nick, even Nick, kidding. Nick, he's a pathological liar. liar. It's not true. Yeah, yeah, the guy's sick. Yeah, we, true. sick in my head. We brought him in here, and he's going to tell something like that. No, it's true. It's fucking true. Oh, this other time, I went to my friend's house, and and he had a fucking... uh. He made so he said he made some edibles, right? So yeah. I go into the kitchen, and there it looks like brownies on the table, right? It looks like brownies. And, hey, one, one second, uh, another lie. Oh, so I'm like, no, are they brownie? Yeah, it's not a lie. Shut the fuck up and let me tell my story. Hey, 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 very important. Very important. Just, just let me speak real quick. I wonder what, what does right. Zaylev have to say about this. Prince do you think it's a Andrew lie, Zaylev? had nothing to do with Epstein. Oh, and he, he, he was just I was a lie. It was a lie. It was a lie. Can we have a moment of silence for Prince Andrew real quick? Yeah, moment of silence for Prince Andrew. Three, two, one. Two, one. Audience, give a round of applause Beautiful. for everyone on this call. Yeah. Yeah. Golden yeah. heart. Golden heart. Thank you. Wait, okay, so I was at my, and he said, there's edibles on the kitchen table. I'm like, okay, I go in there. They look like brownies. So I grab one, and I, I take a fucking, I take a bite out of it. I almost, I fucking almost insta puke. I'm like, what the fuck are these brownies? I ask oh, him. God. And, he, then he goes, and then he goes, they're pancakes. What do you mean? <laughs> they were so burnt that they were black, the bro. Can you fuck? believe that? Can you lie? What's wrong with kind of girl? So true. They look like brownies. You stop I'm fucking lying. lying. This is, this is the truth. No, it's so no, true. No, fucking lying. We know it. Problem. Quit lying. It's true, bro. Dear God, man. He's super stuttering. He's you're stuttering. Lying. You're lying. He was fucking stuttering. And the fuck listen, did I listen. stutter? Audience, audience, let me take this. You can tell when Nicky's lying because he gets a little itch in his nose and you can feel it. You can feel it when he's talking. Yeah, yeah, I got I, but How do you know it's not an itch in my nuts? Oh, bro? come oh. my nuts in here. How's that one sound? You're sick in the head. I'm Another lie. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. It's not a lie. It's not a fucking lie. It's not a lie. Boom heart. Like, take, uh, take a deep breath. Nikki take. take a deep breath, Nikki. It's all good. Breathe uh, out again. You guys do this every time we're in a call. You fucking accuse me of lying. This isn't cool. This isn't fucking cool. We learned to love him, but really, this guy's sick in the head. He has a problem. He can't stop lying. Dear God. I thought you guys were my friends, bro. You are your friends. That's why we can tell you. not cool. We can tell you. not cool. So. Okay, Nikki. Thank you for coming. Get him thank out you, of here. Nikki. Fuck Get you. him out of here. Fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. Fuck you. Get him out.
Yeah. Get him out. That man. was yikes. Thank you. About time. Fucking okay. I was AFK, but what so, happened? Uh, we had Filthy Nick in here as a special guest. He's a great guy. <laughs> really simple conversation. Yeah. You you missed some good points. You love the guy so much. Nothing wrong with him. Golden heart. Yeah. He's an angel. Does, uh, does Weiss Lambert know about uh, Prince Andrew? Hey, Prince Andrew. Don't talk to him like that. Wastelander, say oh, it. Yeah, yeah. Wastelander. yeah, what's going on? He explained to him, did you know that his name's Wasteland Burr because of the uh, New Vegas? Oh, yeah, the Lola. Do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> I told you about this before. It's... He did. He did tell me about that. It's because the sign turns around. Not many people know that, but it's because the sign turns around in uh, New Vegas. I never knew that. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a cool joke. Love it, guys. Wastelander, yeah. Golden Heart. Golden Heart. You guys have it. any more facts about sea slugs? I'm, I'm really intrigued by that, honestly. Like, we do. It's mind boggling. Oh, they are faster, Dead stronger, ass. and more agile than uh, sea snails. Uh, I never knew that. That's so true. You know that sea slugs actually hunt in pack tactics? Oh, really? They use ambush tactics. Did you, did you know they actually use like rudimentary ambushes too? I never knew that. It's, That's really cool. It's amazing. A lot of the CDF skirmish tactics were based off of the research. Like, why? Wow, shut it, Andrew. Oh yeah, my so god. What is you know what you're talking about? But uh, to carry on, these things, they're uh, they're more advanced than their sort of uh, than their other uh, mollusk brethren, aka sea slugs. They're more advanced than just like snails. Everyone, everyone just called it like sea snails. They're not sea snails. They're sea slugs, and they're different. They they rip. And so, what's the difference between them? What's the difference? And gift staff uh, that once you disagree with me, get my DMs, uh, see my address, we can fight. I'll lay you out. I'll lay any of you out. Oh yeah, since you're under a pussy. You're stuck in the head, Trash. I have a question, though, for Purple Haze. Uh, why did you change your name to Filthy Julian after uh, you quit ATF? Well, they're coming back. Yeah, yeah, we're bringing them back. That ass. Yeah. Yeah, we're bringing them back. Damn, son. Uh, to wrap all this up, what do you guys think about ATF as a whole? Like, every single one of you. Like, what do you think oh, about this whole game? Shit. I hate it. Horrible, man. Everyone in the uh, I don't want to be second my it. If you guys just open your eyes, everyone in the audience, open your eyes, look around. You know, Chad's just running the Jeff business. I respect the hustle. Chad's fine. But he doesn't realize the corruption that has gone on in this game he's created. And I think he's got to deal with it. For far too long as well. Yeah, I think that's a good wrap up for this episode. Thank you all for coming out today. But real uh, quick though, hey, real quick though, why? So like, why do you guys hate ATF? Like, besides all that, I mean, what, do, we, do we need another reason? It's sickening. It's sickening. I think the only reason we really need is just that 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 horrible uh, the the cult. Oh, it's almost it's almost like a cult running this game. And uh, I don't know. Damn. It's it's sick. All right, give Rillard in a moment to explain. What were you saying, Rillard? Really? Pizza, so I mean, I think he's eating pizza right um, now. I am. Uh, shout, out, shout out to John. Shout out to Rillard. Golden Heart, love. I think. Uh, I love that guy, man. Fuck him. I love him. Who doesn't? Bro, I, yeah, I, I love he's this guy. Awesome I stuff. forgot his name. I think it's like um, Despot. Oh, he's he's a, he's a kind soul. Oh yeah, I think, yeah, I think every single one. Oh, shout out to him, um, real quick. Uh, obviously, Andre. Uh, in all realness, guys. though, they're good devs. Oh, I wouldn't know. I would know. I'm. I, um, if there if there was one, I, I I'm not letting on it. I guess I'm not cool enough. Uh, shout out, shout out to Chad. Love the guy, Golden Heart. Yeah. Uh, oh. Shout out to Daredevil. Uh, shout out to Interstellar oh, for making ATF. Daredevil. Shout out to Dinobot. Uh, shout out to Wasteland oh, Podcast for not letting me say the N word. Respect that. Uh, respect the hustle. And uh, I mean, that's it. Love you guys. You guys are golden hearts. Golden hearts in the sky. I got one more. I got one more. Julian, what is it? Uh, uh, shout out Joseph Bros Tito. Uh, shout out oh, Wholesome well, JoJo. Uh, my homie Span runs that. Love you. Um, yeah, that's it. I respect that. All right, yeah. One more time. One more time. One more time. For, 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 yeah. uh, just, just for everyone, we talked about it. Okay, ready? Three, two, Three, one. two, one. Round of applause. Golden heart. Golden heart. Golden heart. Come on now. I think I think I think that's a that's a good wrap up. Thank you. That's a good wrap. Hey, thank you thing. for coming, guys. It was amazing. Yeah, it's uh, been a good it's episode. Shut up, Rob. 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 Shut up, R